What's up guys, welcome to a new episode of my vlog, Ibadia here from Copenhagen and I'm here to show you one day of my life. Let's go. Every day I wake up at 6.30, close the door carefully not to wake up my girlfriend. This is the time that I use to answer emails, send some bills, book some flight. This time is to send a report to my Olympic committee about the first six months. 7.30 I eat my breakfast. I need a big breakfast because the practice starts at 9.30 and I have a long drive to Sweden. Then I prepare my bag. I should do it the night before, but because I'm a lazy person, I always do it in the last minute. At 8 o'clock, I'm leaving my apartment. As I said earlier, I have about 15 minutes to drive to Eslov. I like to read a lot of books, so it's a great time for me to listen to audiobook and use the time wisely. I arrive in the hall little before 9 and I have about 45 minutes to get ready because I'm a hall man. I don't really need to present this guy, you already know him. And you might think that he's happy to practice with me but he's celebrating the victory of Swedish football national team that beat Japan at the Women's World Cup.
Guys, if you like the content of this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe the channel. That will mean a lot to me. But wow, what an amazing practice with Truls. Uh, I really like to practice with him because he's a very creative person and he always tries to mess with your rhythm. My goal for this training was to make a lot of footwork because I'm still in my pre-season uh, tr training. And uh, because I'm feeling very good right now, um, I implement uh, some service and receive uh, exercises. And actually, me and Truls uh, before the training, we actually speak about the importance of playing uh, after a half long ball. Because in WTT, we are playing on the T bar tables most of the time, and they are very slippery tables. Go and look my previous vlog, and I actually talked a lot about it. And then sometimes the service is going half long, or the receive that we want to touch short is going half long. And, uh, and often we are not ready to play these kind of balls and uh, that's why uh, me and Truls we decided to prepare for these kind of balls. So as you see in, earlier in the practice I make a lot of exercises uh, that he has to play short or half long and I have to judge the right balls and he was making a lot of, uh, of uh, exercises where he served half long and I spin and then we went for, there for free. I think most of the young player or coaches, if they want to work different exercises, um, I think that uh, they are just making like one guy top spin and the guy block. But I think that is more realistic and close to the match when you serve uh, in purpose half long and the guy spin and then you try to win the point after that because that's what's happening in match. Yeah, I wanted to, to work uh, uh, footwork after a counter loop or a defense with backhand. 
this is the, my way that I try to work my defense game and then I try to yeah to mix the defense game and the uh, and the footwork and the truth I go with that and then that's why we make like yeah the practice like this. Okay now it's the time to work out and look who is in the hole ready to work out. After a nice uh, day like this, uh, I just come home and then make a recovery session. Go and check my recovery session in the Singapore vlog. I made a long uh, recovery session for the hip and the glutes uh, because I was very stiff there. But that's the end of this vlog, I hope you enjoyed it. And if you like the content of this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel, that would mean a lot to me. Thank you guys and see you soon.